According to the World Bank, heat waves in India could soon break the human survivability limit. Over the last 60 years, India has witnessed a rise in meteorological droughts and heat waves with the frequency and intensity increasing. The IPCC had warned us of the same in August 2021 with heat waves lasting 25 times longer by 2036-2065 in the worst case scenario. Temperatures crossed 48 degrees Celsius in the national capital earlier this year with the hottest March ever recorded. This could be devastating for poor and marginalized communities who live in inadequately ventilated, hot and crowded homes without proper access to cooling. Only 8% of Indian households own air conditioning units, according to the India Cooling Action Plan 2019. The economic consequences will be high too. because heat exposed work contributes to nearly half of the country's gross domestic product 380 million people or 75% of the workforce depends on heat exposed labor india's long term food and public health security will depend on a reliable cold chain network being the world's third largest producer of pharmaceuticals pre covid 19 india lost approximately 20% of temperature sensitive medical products and 25% of vaccines due to broken cold chains amounting to losses of 313 million dollars annually a sustainable cooling strategy needs to be created to help the country in its post covid recovery since it will boost investments create jobs reduce emissions and secure the supply chains of medical care products health infrastructure as well as food <laughs>